The goal was to collect 377 books. We dropped off 407. But thanks to friends, family, and perfect strangers, Sydney and her husband Ben exceeded their expectations. The goal that we set was 377, one for every day um, that Lincoln was alive. Lincoln is this little guy's big brother. This is uh, my second son. Yeah, yes, and he is 14 months old. Sam's helping his mom honor Lincoln for what would have been his third birthday. A therapist once told me that parenting doesn't end when Lincoln died, that I have to find a new way um, to parent him and his memory. And so this was a great way to honor that and just celebrate his life and his love of books. A new book for a child for every day Lincoln was alive. We wanted to do something special and let's not make it a sad day. We wanted to do something happy. Because after 377 beautiful days on this earth. <laughs> happiest child, he biggest belly laugh, brightest smile, big blue eyes and the hair and lots and lots of hair. Lincoln passed away. Now his mom is trying to do all she can to spread awareness for SUDC, Sudden Unexplained Death in Childhood. It receives no research dollars um, from the federal government. It's all privately funded research. And I don't want any parent to have to experience what we have. Lincoln went to the library every week. Is this one of your favorites? Well, so this was Lincoln's favorite. Now kids all over the community will be able to read some of the books that made Lincoln laugh. But we got several um, copies of books in English and in Spanish. Inside every one of these books will be Lincoln's name and a little bit of his story. We just want to make sure that, that, that his reach is far and wide and that um, as many kids as possible get the chance to read and enjoy these books. Oh, it makes my mama heart happy. <laughs> Sawyer Bussey, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.